There are small cars, and there are small cars. And then there's Dodge Aspen, the small car with the accent on comfort, and a lot of other new items that changed a lot of people's ideas on what a small car should be all about. It was January 1976 when Aspen arrived on the small car scene. It was designed to be different than any other small car on the market. It was, and it is. Aspen came on with the idea of delivering big car roominess, wide visibility, front and rear, and to give the driver a feeling of positive stability and handling and a command of the road. Our beautiful Aspen's modern design has the ride and control that comes from its unique isolated transverse torsion bar suspension system. It provides a feeling of ride and comfort that is big car all the way. How important is all this? Well, we compared the 77 Aspen to the 77 Chevrolet Nova and Pontiac's Ventura, basically the same cars. The GM cars stick with the same old suspension design they had in 1968. Front coil springs combined with rear leaf springs. A front anti-sway bar and radial glass belted tires, both standard on the special edition coupe and sedans, add to Aspen's feeling of control. Aspen has some ideas about performance too. You can choose from a durable 225 slant 6 engine, a popular 318 cubic inch V8, and a powerful 360 V8. Outside of California and high altitude areas, there's also a new optional 225 two-barrel Super 6 with more go and quicker response than the single-barrel 6. We made it standard on wagons. And there is the new 364 barrel electronic lean burn engine available on Aspen Coupes. An underhood computer monitors seven different engine and driving conditions to give you improved performance. Nova doesn't have it, nor does any other GM car. Notice, just three engine choices and no standard V8. There are other performance items to look for under the Aspen hood too. A 305 ampere battery with a thermal guard shield to protect it against damaging engine heat. Nova offers a smaller 275 ampere battery. No thermal guard shield. Aspen alternator is 41 amps strong. Nova's is just 37. Power front disc brakes are standard on Aspen Special Edition. They're a required $61 option on Nova Concours V8s. Power steering is also standard on Special Edition coupes and sedans. It costs you $146 extra on Nova Concours. Aspen was designed with the driver in mind but it offers something extra for everyone in the car. Roominess. Aspen sedans have more leg room, hip room, and rear head room, more space inside than the General Motors compacts. Space for comfort, real comfort. Aspen Special Edition coupes and sedans feature a standard super soft all vinyl 6040 bench seat with folding center armrests individual seat adjustments, dual reclining seat bags, comfort and convenience. Nova doesn't offer a 6040 seat. The comfort of convenience. Inside door handles are easy to get at and use. It's not all that easy with Nova. The instrumentation built into the modern Aspen includes easy-to-read fuel, alternator, and temperature gauges. Nova has a fuel gauge only. It sticks with warning lights for the others. And they let you know when you're in trouble after you're already in trouble. Styling is a matter of taste, but Aspen proves a small car doesn't have to come off looking small and boxy. Wide color keyed vinyl inserts are standard on Aspen Special Edition coupes and sedans. They're $51 extra on the Concourse Coupe, and it isn't even offered on Nova sedans. Functional options are also a matter of choice. 
the sunroof is one of the choices that Nova doesn't offer. And now there's a new out-of-sight T-bar roof available on Aspen Coupes. Remove the tinted glass panels and Aspen has the open-air feeling of a convertible. And there's something else you can't get in Nova, or any GM or Ford Compact. A six-passenger station wagon. In fact, you can't get a GM compact size wagon. There aren't any. Our wagon has nearly 73 cubic feet of take-along space, over 43 inches wide at wheel housing and six feet long for taking bicycles and camping gear and what have you. And when it comes to small car economies, Aspen has advantages there too, over both Nova and Ventura. Small car owners expect small maintenance costs. You get it with Aspen's automatic transmission, which requires no maintenance under normal driving conditions. GM compacts do. And Aspen offers longer spark plug change intervals. Another savings. What about mileage? Comparing the base single barrel six cylinder engine with the standard six, both with manual transmissions, Aspen has the edge. A combined EPA mileage of 23 MPG overall to Nova's 22. It's like we said, there are small cars and there are small cars. And then there's Aspen, the unbelievable small car with the accent on comfort and a lot of other new items that change a whole lot of people's ideas on what a small car should be all about.